just a quick video that I wanted to shoot in relation to uh, the relevance of two million pounds and the residence nil rate band. So we're talking specifically or strictly from an inheritance tax perspective for UK taxpayers. Two million pounds and the residence nil rate band. What's the correlation? What's the connection? If one's estate exceeds two million pounds, then the residence, sorry, I should go back, I should explain what is the residence nil rate band to begin with. The residence nil rate band is in addition to the nil rate band, which is £325,000, which each taxpayer has available to offset against his or her death estate. Okay, so £325,000. Anything in excess of that is subject to UK inheritance tax on death at 40%. The government introduced back in 2017 a further band, which is known as the residence nil rate band, which is a further £175,000, which is available subject to certain conditions being met. Broadly speaking, it has to be your own home, your primary residence, and that primary, primary residence should be passed on to your direct descendants. If that is the case, £175,000 can also be used in addition to the £325,000 can also be used to offset against your death estate, which includes your personal home valued at, you know, £800,000, for example. Um, this is quite beneficial. Why? Because between husband and wife, it makes the 650, turns the 650 into £1 million. However, we come to the whole, you know, the point of this video, which is the £2 million. If one's estate exceeds two million pounds, then the residence nil rate band begins to taper. Okay, so as the personal allowance tapers when income exceeds hundred thousand pounds, for example, or as the uh, the annual allowance begins to taper at certain points, the residence nil rate band also begins to taper once the estate exceeds two million pounds once it exceeds uh, and it's for and it, it tapers by one pound for every two pounds i think i need to slow down a bit <laughs> um <clears throat> the residence nil rate band will begin to taper once the estate exceeds two million pounds by one pound for every two pound in excess so if you do a quick calculation uh, and if the math is mathing then once you exceed an estate of 2.35 million pounds, why? Because 175,000 pounds times by two is 350,000 pounds. 2.35 million, once that is exceeded, the full residence nil rate band is tapered. So when I see estates exceeding 2.35 million, for example, one of the first sort of, you know, outlooks would, not, not the first, but it is definitely one of the outlooks that needs to be considered is how do we reduce this estate by you know gifting or trust or whatever it may be, how do we reduce this, this estate to then re what's the word to re um, you know when you bring when you bring it back in to reinstate to reinstate the residence nil rate band? How do we do this? Because one hundred seventy five thousand pounds at forty percent is seventeen point five k times four. Is about 47 and a half, 70,000 pounds. So you're saving tax uh, at 70,000 pounds. You're saving inheritance tax, 70,000 pounds, which is quite significant. So that should always be considered. If you do have an estate, you know, exceeding anything exceeding over 500,000 pounds generally, or as a married couple, any estate exceeding 1 million pounds, please do reach out for bespoke inheritance tax advice myself. You know, I've looked at so many cases now. I have a team, I have a strong team. Together, we would look at your circumstances, your personal circumstances, your family circumstances, your goals for the future, um, your assets and the rest of it. And we would definitely be able to advise you and help you save, you know, for example, £70,000 in this, in this particular example. If your estate is in excess of £2 million, you definitely need to reach out for a chat. My name is Omar. I am a Chartered Tax Advisor regulated by the Chartered Institute of Taxation and founder of Asra Tax, a specialist tax advisory firm. We get involved in all matters relating to UK tax, 
So, you know, visit our website, reach out. My email address is down below and I shall speak to you soon. But in any instance, I hope you found this video beneficial and useful. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Speak to you soon. Bye.